What is up guys, it's Dutch19, you're bringing you some auction free gameplay to upload to the YouTube channel, so let's get it! It used to be a military base. Well, it used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry found a station here, I think, for a bit. Unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one polar year they changed bear the sugar bear cookies and ruined it. Polar bear sugar cookies, boys. Alex? Hey, still with us? You haven't said anything for like 10 minutes. Yeah, um, sorry. I'm so you all moved in? What I did um, guys. not, not really. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a, you know, actually, I'm not even going to tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> okay. No, wait, what happened? I feel like I haven't heard this. I want to know. He got lost in some gardens and he thought she worked there and blah, blah, blah. They hit it off. Aww. Oh. That's downright adorable. <coughs> and you guys just met tonight? Yeah, I was, um... I'd been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out, so... And what? Does that no, make you I to her, then? Hey, uh, second like cousin? Up. He's my stepbrother. <laughs> oh, yeah. I forgot that was even a thing. Well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool Water new sibling boys. living right in your house. Sharing your toothbrush. Wearing your clothes. Yeah, no, it's a nice perk, I guess. Unless you're like a pirate or something. Just a klepto, so you're in luck. Hey, there's an old ship's wheel up here. It's a replica from a Portuguese caravel, it says. Uh, yeah, yeah, I think the Portuguese discovered the island. I don't know. I mostly slept through the maritime portion of history class. So, how do you two know each other? Uh, who's the, uh, who's driving this? That's Sea Captain Karen. She's doing us a favor. You'll notice we're the only ones doing the voyage. How you doing up there, Karen? Yeah, what's up with that? Does no one normally go there at night? Nobody really lives there, so no. And Karen's not gonna mind that we're spending the night. But yeah, we're old friends. Embarrassingly old friends. Like, we should have found better people to hang out with by now. <laughs> Check I don't leave behind any grandchildren. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. This would be like, yeah, let's do it. And it's Jonas? Not Jonah? Yeah, Jonas. Like Jonas Salk? Right, patient zero, AIDS guy. Jonas. It means oppressor, right? Yeah, but I mean, my sign's cancer, and it's not like my hair's falling out or anything. Here's good. Come on, Alex, join the fun. There, great. I'll magic erase all the warts out and stuff, so don't worry. Hey, Alex, you brought the radio, right? The little portable one? Yeah, of course. Perfect. Can you pull it out a second? Sure. There's the little guy. Our high school has a radio station, and Carly, she's a friend of mine. Which I played because that song has been stuck in my head since I woke up this morning. I'm talking, guys. But, Sorry. Oh. Oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddies are probably just touching down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach, or whatever we call it now. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band, so hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with Baby Carrots. Baby Carrots, Baby Carrots, Baby Carrots, Baby Carrots. <laughs> ah, that's awesome. I hope Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. Baby carrots, boys. It's time to get some water. We must be getting close. There's no radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, no. You'll see. I don't expect too much, but nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. You'll see. <coughs> There's supposed to be a radio broadcast, something like that, in the island, guys. That's what he's talking about. Look at us, we all look pretty cool. Alright, loading screens, that's great I guess. 
Hey, uh, Frenzy, did you include your audio or no? Oh, no, I can. All right, well, don't include it. <laughs> Yeah, don't include it. It shouldn't be included, right? Huh? Smell that clean Never. air, boys and girls. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. Yeah, um, anybody need a smoke? I have a full pack. Uh, oh, oh. Uh, no thanks. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, Fuck so... Me, Papa, Alex, call me daddy. you can bum one off me if you're empty. I forget if you're a fellow addict. Yeah, sure. Really? Since when do you smoke? Last time you tried it, I thought you were gonna vomit on my shoes. Being polite. You should try it sometime. Okay, smoke, just remember, smoke, smoke, aim smoke. to throw up in the water. Here's the smoke if you want it. Smoke, smoke! <laughs> <coughs> you alright? <coughs> There. Smoke, smoke. Right. My other friend should be up and around the bed. Actually, that. I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but can I have like two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? And you can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends. Uh. Wait, is is something wrong? What is it? Nothing's wrong. Nothing's wrong. It'll just take two minutes. Super All right, fast. Two minutes. All right, but <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're gonna have all night to say, like, whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... No, it's, I wanna it's hear fine, it. Ren. I wanna go hear on up it. ahead I and we'll catch up with you. Right. Um, okay. I guess. Though this is a really strange Wait, way to start off, splitting up. It'll be fast. Thanks, man. I'll just be up the hill, in case... whatever. Ren right. seems okay. nice. He's funny, you know? Reminds me of a guy I know back home. Yeah, I mean, he's harmless, but yeah, he's nice. Listen, I just wanted to grab you ahead of time and say you've been cool about everything. And I guess it's just for me, I, I, I've never moved anywhere. And like getting a new family at the same time kind of feels like I'm skipping the training wheels. And not that it's been bad or anything. You and your mom have been great. Yeah, I'm sure you miss your friends. Eh, there's not much to miss, to be honest. Huh. Oh, and thanks for setting up the attic for me. It's cool how it's like a little bedroom. I was in the basement at my old house, so this... Yeah, no problem. Anytime. Oh. Oh. It's nice at night, isn't it? I don't want to bring up anything bad. <laughs> yeah. We can what? catch back up with Ren now. I didn't All mean right. to take so long. So... There is a little story behind why she and him are like, you know, family now and all that. Um, I'll say in the future of the game. It's kind of kitschy, right? It's kind of kitschy. Yeah, it's like a quiche. Uh, so it's kind of awkward between them because you know they're uh, just. I think you know, they block this off at night since of... nobody needs to use it, or maybe they just had a parade. Sure, either one. Uh, if nobody lives here and the stores are all closed, whose car is this? Oh, there's always that one lonely car in every parking lot. That's kind of true. There's not very much cars in parking lots, so it's much I see. Ah, oh, I forgot this was even here. It's a monument to some submarine that was sunk off the coast. Oh, do the, the, um, the radio guide thing they talked about on the boat, you know? It's what, but 102.3? I just want to see how it works. Uh, okay, sure. I think they said it's... Named after the Hawaiian god of the sea, the USS Kanaloa was launched on January 15th, 1941, and commissioned into service at the end of that year. I've never heard of this before. Kind of creepy in a way, right? On October yeah, 28th, 1943, I hate thinking about it. It, was sunk it reminds me of those scenes in movies where the sailors have to seal somebody up to drown or else the flooding will take the whole ship, you know? Yeah, no, I always thought submarine duty was like the worst possible war assignment. There's nowhere to go if something goes wrong. As well as 12 army. Yeah. Named after the Hawaiian... Alrighty. On with the game. I've never heard any of this. I'm kind of thinking a different path than what I usually took on the last uh, gameplay I did. 
Parks and Facilities Office. Friend's sister Allison used to work there. You'd like her. She's tall. Um, all right. Anybody else wants to go inside this? <clears throat> Where's your lead at? The world, I guess. Man, they close up early. I guess no point in staying open if nobody's here. Uh, sorry. That's true. Hello, kids. Look, the other guys and gals must be further off, so hey, what up, be quick now. Okay, speed read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops and a beach. Nobody lives here except for some geriatric named Mrs. Adler. But, as God is my witness, we'll never mention her or any other old person's name again. We are here to drink and be stupid, a tradition apparently started by bored recruits in the 1950s who would sneak dates over from the coastal towns. They literally called it trolling. Uh-huh. Wow. That's actually kind of funny. Yeah, it's like kids at camp or whatever. Oh, like so, to summarize, they're the not allowed here after dark. Day. The town is shut down, and we, the Kamina High junior class, have come. The beaten path officially ends oh, here. The beach is past the fence. I think Jerry. Put me to beat the fuck out of my dick. So, guys, um, About 20 minutes this is ago. the map of the whole game. Uh, last time I left off, I was at Beacon Beach. Uh, you know, just, you know, talking on a campfire, exploring, and then I left off with the gameplay. So we're going to go a little bit ahead of that since this is a live stream, and I'm going to upload this to YouTube. Uh, also, quick little note, I will be uploading some long, dark live streams later on, you know, because um, I was suggested that by my friend that does long, dark gameplay now. So I'm going to have that in the link of this, the link in, it's going to be in the, description I can't talk um, on the YouTube video to go check out his channel Matt Goss you already know what's going on guys so go check out his channel he has a whole bunch of gameplays of I think long dark and some other things of us being stupid you know some skits and all that so go check out his channel Jerry told me that there's a way that you used to get over there but I'm blanking on uh, what it was but it's not I mean it can't be too difficult well look it must be something I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge yeah well let's try it so to summarize we are not allowed here after dark okay. the town is shut down and we the Kamina High junior class have come to commit improper acts and the other thing is the weirdo caves weirdo the caves weirdo cave. the whole reason alex brought her radio is because when you go to the it's like the front <coughs> hopefully he was done talking um i kind of explored a little bit of it uh while doing a different gameplay of this uh which i didn't get to upload sadly but um yeah guys uh don't worry I will be uploading long dark episodes. Uh, I'll do a live stream on that here later when it download. Oh, uh, before we get there, I should I should probably mention that. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Who's that? That's so. There's this girl, Nona. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me. So just you know, yeah. j just be cool, okay? No pouting or complaining or anything. All right? Deal. Ren, relax. Oh, and okay, Jonas. Now that we're dumpster buddies, what was the thing that you said to Alex back there? Do you have one of those vestigial tales or something? Uh, it was nothing, really. Just leave it alone, Ren, all right? You don't have to hear everything. I don't have to hear everything, but I want to hear everything. It's not a big deal, really. Just forget about it. Yeah, nothing, nothing to concern you, brother. <laughs> what? What's going on? Should I be scared? Some birds flew out of a hole and scared me, that's all. Picture. <laughs> birds. Cheep, cheep, cheep. You big goof. Hey, is this like a part of the base? This far out on the beach? I honestly don't know what that is. But remember, you can pull out your little radio and tune to that tour station if you want. Alrighty. This data command annex, as it had been dubbed, was used during the base's early years as the communication nerve center for outside military installations. It was also the primary office of Marianne Bozek, a communications protection through the invention of the famed wall system. A type of radio frequency identification, wall, standing for wave-assisted lock, 
assigned each person who was stationed at Fort Milner a call sign through which they could use their portable two-wave radios to unlock prescribed doors and gates. Though the mechanics are considered outmoded today, the island still uses this security method to honor its rich history. Hi. Well, that's pretty cool. Uh, hopefully there's not an echo, guys. Uh, if there is an echo, go ahead and, uh, you know, I'll just turn it up to a uh, party. More of party. This data... Because I'm not trying to get an echo, so I'm going to check it again. Command Annex, as it had been dubbed, was used... Uh, I think there is an echo, so... This is during the base's early years as the communication... I think it's stopped. I'm not sure. I don't have a computer or anything to check um, the live stream. So, Jonas is trying to date this girl, no Noah? No Noah? Something like that? Um, that's why I tried getting to happen on the last gameplay. I'm going to try it again to see what happens. Climb over some rocks and jump down the cliffs. Long fall. You know, it looks like a long fall. Reginald, I hear you over there. Hey, guys. Wait, I was saying. I was about to tell a story. What was it? About Brad's car. Oh, well, that can wait. Hey. We started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play Beach Nanny, so. Uh, yeah. Everyone, this is Jonas. Jonas? Everyone. Hey. Hi. And Jonas, that's... Who are you again? Jonas. Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Stepbrother? Really? Yeah, I know. It's a trip, right? Uh... Yeah, this is his first night here, so everybody be on your best behavior. Treat him as you would a scary dog. Palms out. <laughs> that's, um... I don't bite. It's fine. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Oh, You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Cool. Yeah. Um, what's your name again? That is Clarissa. How but are she's... your stepbrother? Like, what does that even mean? Um... My mom married his dad, so family, law, and all. Yeah, well, I guess this is happening now. This is yep. a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where's everyone else? Nicole had that tennis everyone thing. Else? And? Uh, who else was supposed to come? Anyone? Everyone? Clarissa, we... <laughs> We took the last ferry. I thought more would show up, but... <laughs> oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? Huh, <laughs> that's it. That's who you brought. That's the group. Ugh, oh, come on, Clarissa. I'm fun. I'm hip. I'm with it. Listen to yourself. Wait, aren't you I'm all, hip. like, friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to, like, a creepy neighbor. And you I just met. <laughs> yeah. Hey, uh... what about me? What about you? Oh. I get it, I'm not even on the spectrum. You see, Jonas, normally this is like a 20 deep rager, but Pat had a party last weekend and- And a bunch of kids got caught TPing the school. But this is great, <laughs> right? We're on Edwards Island. Forget those losers who couldn't handle the weekend, who didn't think we could make it, who lost my invitation, who had to go Faster. on there. We've been hearing about this for years, and now we're gonna do it. This is gonna be amazing, scoop, right? Scoop, 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 right, guys? Scoop, scoop. Yay, awesomeness. Yeah! Scoop, 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 scoop. On to the next area, Scoop. Like I said, I'm gonna try to get uh, Joan. I don't know what his name is anymore. <laughs> I can't remember names on this game. I'm gonna try to get the two lovebirds to, you know, actually love each other. Um, hopefully, I can do that. Uh, I don't know how to do it. Alrighty, <laughs> so uh, I'm gonna probably make this gameplay 30 minutes. Why not? You know, outlive what's fire, uh, man's oh, great yeah. equalizer. So <laughs> what's the um, what's the like thing to do here, other than obviously go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Krueger? We should explore the island. I mean, if this is pretty much a one-time thing, we shouldn't waste it. Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh. You mean Maggie Adler? Yeah. Nowhere. She's dead. What? Yep, killed over three days ago. It was all over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Hey, we could go see her house. 
It must be huge. She was rich as- No, we can't see her house. There's a giant fence, and I don't want to tear my jeans trying to climb it. And to answer your previous well, question, Jonas, it. the thing to do is lay on the beach and drink till you can't remember where you are. And let's play truth or slap. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Ease him into the night's festivities. Truth or slap? What's that? We used to call it hippo, until we got tired of people asking, why is it called hippo? Because you get to yell, you're a dirty hippo, before you slap someone. You get asked a question. You have to tell the truth, but if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Yeah, fun. An excuse to hit run. Hey, I'm the truthiest truth, whoever <laughs> truth, All right, let's uh, just get on with it. Okay, so, first, we're gonna... I'll start. Ren. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You want to go out with Nona, right? Clarissa! Wait, wait, wait. I want to hear his answer. Clarissa, come on. You're supposed to ask, like, have you ever stole something? Not super weirdo probing stuff. You ask probing stuff if you play the game right, Alex. Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something mm -hmm. like... Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods. Now no, just say so. I, I mean, I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's... I just like her as a friend. That's... That's all. She's cool. She's... She's just a friend. Oh, yeah, right. Okay. Thank you, Clarissa. All right. Great. Let's just move on. Okay. It's Ren's turn, right? He gets to ask somebody something. Alex, Alex, Alex! <laughs> Uh-oh. I just have to think <laughs> about which nerve I want to so delicately pinch. Oh, please. Shoot. I can take it. Okay. Mary, screw, kill. Me, Nona, and Clarissa. Why? <laughs> it's fun. It's funny. I don't know. And Jonas is family now, technically, so he's excluded. Well, I'd marry Nona. I like the quiet types. I'm flattered, I think. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you're going down the line. Who'd you do the dirty with? Clarissa, obviously. <laughs> obviously. You're not going to call her out on that? No, I believe her. I mean, look at me. And wait. Wait, that means you'd kill me? Out of everyone here, your best friend. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't kill him. Honestly. Sorry, it, it just I worked out that way, I swear. I and I'm the only guy. This fire. is Miss Andrea. <laughs> Miss Andrea, I say. Okay, settle down. I wouldn't kill him. So, wouldn't. Alex's but, turn? Uh, yep, just the way ladies' choice. Time, so. Alex gets to pick who to ask something of. Oh, great, here we go. What's your favorite uh, stuffed animal? Professor. Oh, boy. Yes, Mum? This is pretty fun just watching, I'll admit. Well, wait. Do you like anyone? Like... Like, like anyone? There's no one in school worth liking now. What? Come on. Ouch. So, no, I don't. But nice try. Oh, Clarissa's turn now. Time. Alex, First you time. got a new brother. Pretty exciting. I'm sure Jonas is excited, or maybe excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything, you know? Unsure. It's a lot to take in and adjust to. I'm, um, fine. What's your point, Clarissa? I'm just saying what Jonas is already thinking. That statistics show if you get divorced once, you're probably gonna get divorced again. Probably. And the fact is, your mom divorced your dad. So let's put his mind at ease yeah. and hear why. I, I don't I don't really need to know the situation before. Okay, just get to whatever point this is getting to. The point is, why'd your parents get a divorce? Just so Jonas can yeah, hear it from you. Clarissa, I don't really care why they got a divorce. Just that Alex's mom is happy now. But how can we be sure? You know why. Michael died and it broke everything and they couldn't handle it. The end. Well, now you know, Jonas. Don't die and everything will be fine. Okay, Clarissa, you- What? You know, guys, honestly, I think I'm pretty much ready to do anything else besides this game. Wait, let's, let's not stop like this. We should let- Game's over, Ren, I won. And to celebrate, I'm gonna sit on the beach and drink Great. and maybe Chill I'm feeling spicy, it. even take a nap. Maybe we could. And that's exactly what Nona's gonna do too. Fine. I'm Whatever. Be Miss Nona. Pouty on the beach all night if you want. I'm not gonna let you ruin this for me. I appreciate ah. your permission to be pouty. Thank you. Cheese. If you guys in your scavenger hunt ah. or playing Ring Around the Rosy happen to find anything oh, no. more interesting than a slowly dying starfish, you be sure to just let me know. Super. Sure. We'll grab you if we find any. Um. Island Bigfoots. Island Bigfoots. Exactly. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. No, no, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would. I'm very clingy, Ren. <sighs> Fine. 
Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? But like I said, you're a strapping young Don't lad. Get the fire! Okay, Make come on. Bigger! Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Bigger! Oh yeah, is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. Bigger, bigger, bigger. Alex, you want to check out the caves, or...? Uh, in a sec, Later. okay? Yeah, just let me know. Thanks for making the fire. Yeah, sure. Gotta put those Owl Scout lessons to use. Uh, thanks for the beer. Tell your cousin that was nice. Eh, she owed me. I lied about where she was so she could see her boyfriend, Richard. I mean, Dick. Ah. But you're welcome. <laughs> You know, Ren, he's like, kind of like totally into you. Yeah, no crap. The guy was practically humping her leg when he asked her to this. It's not a big secret. No, no, Ren's a great guy. And there's no pressure or anything, but I just want to put in a good word for him, for whatever it's worth. Look, Alex, Ren seems nice, oh, and say this again. I know he's your friend and, you know, Come whatever, on. but I'm just not in the mood for something right now. Um, so if you could just, like, Tell him that, just so he, like, doesn't no. get his hopes up or whatever. I'd, um, appreciate it. Just think about it, will you? He's not a bad guy. I know, but you think about it, too. Think about dating him? No. Think about telling him I'm not into it so he doesn't, like, get his hopes up or whatever. Oh. Uh, okay. But I want y'all to date. I would like you to look see that in this game. Relaxed. I am relaxed. Clarissa, I want to be friends. Can we be friends? <laughs> this is like a very special episode of Fart Date. <laughs> I'm friends with everybody, Alex, all right? Relax. Huh. Everyone as in me as well? How'd you get the fire started? We are the fire starter. A lighter. We are truly marvels of modern science. Let's stroke the fire again and kind of went down over the time. Get this fire started. Bigger. Batter. And uh, my arm is torching around. I'm All right, well, time to go exploring, guys. Island living, huh? Uh, yep. Get any reception, or...? No, not really. I, uh, didn't realize our cell phones wouldn't work on the island. Kinda promised my dad I'd call him. He never used to be this, uh, needy, but since my mom died, he's kinda shortened the leash on me a bit. He's gonna be kinda pissed. Not a good way to start the move, huh? Yeah, I should've warned you. The technology here, I think they just got, like, mechanical pens, so... Oh, it's no big deal. Don't worry about it. I'm just gonna write him a text, so in case I wander into a couple of bars or something, he might get it. Let's hop this thing and check in with Run. Alright, let's do it. Come on, I'll push you over. Whenever you're ready. So, the cave. What's your bets? On a scale of 1 to 10, how weird's it gonna be? Mm, probably a five. Weird enough to remember, but not weird enough to tell anybody about it after. <laughs> All right. Hey, Let's Chris seems cave. to be her normal annoying self. Sorry about that. Eh, it's not your fault. I think somebody dumped pig's know, blood on her in a previous like life, this. and now she just wants to get ahead of the curve. Uh, <laughs> I would, I yeah, probably. Thanks for uh, not ratting me out to Nona during the uh, the game. I didn't yeah, think you would, but, you know, you could've, and you didn't, so thanks. Yeah, Ren, about Nona. What? Did she say anything? Because if she said anything, you should tell me. Like, word for word. I go think you should go for it. Go for it. Oh, go yeah? It. Yeah, I agree. No, I mean, what do you it. got to lose, right? Well, I guess nothing except for my sense of self-worth, but makes sense to me. Now. Who's ready to have their minds blown? If you don't mean that literally, I am... Me, me, me. 
Oh, wait, actually, I almost forgot. Gonna take a little magic trip to Cupcake Town. Those look like brownies. Brownie Town. <laughs> no, no. Oh, you're the only one? Gimme. <laughs> oh, no. These are just for me. I've been waiting a long time for this. Yeah, maybe it's best he's the test balloon for this anyway. Uh, eat brownies? Mm. Delicious. Okay, so see these little piles of rocks? The kids before us always leave them here, so you know where to try and tune in the signals. So you're gonna want to stand basically right around here, and just tune the dial left or right until you start hearing some weirdness. Just pull out your radio. It's like aliens or something like that, so. Yeah. Um, get ready to get abducted. Abducted, guys. Let's go. Holy crap! Wow, it's even cooler than I thought it would be. This is insane. How. How is this. How can this be possible? Maybe the tuning's like unblocking a weather balloon or something? <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Well, it's just crazy, then, because I don't know. If you move around, it kind of changes, too, I think. Like, over at this pile. Here, come over here and try it. Let's go towards the pile, guys. All right, let's look for some. There it is. Um, okay. no. This is so cool. <laughs> I know! Clarissa and Nona should see this, right? I mean, I know it's, like, weird with you guys or whatever for some reason, but they... They're fine where they are. Okay, just what is Clarissa's issue with you two? She dated Michael for five seconds like three years ago. It was for a couple of months a year and a half ago. <sighs> she should just seriously get over it already. Clarissa's the kind of person who doesn't feel full unless she's pissed at somebody, so... Huh. Brownies are kicking in. Did that make sense? Are you Those okay? Are weed he I think so. Weed now, there's another cool God, spot, I think, brownies. over here. All right, time for the last one, guys. Ready for the magic? I don't know what's gonna pop. Uh, it sounds so... Yeah, it sounds... Uh... It sounds... <sighs> like, painful. Yeah. Wait, what was that? That's Morse code for something. Morse code for something. There's like... I, I just don't know what it this is. This is gonna sound stupid, but there's like something in here. Famous last words. Famous last... No, I see it too. I'm sure there is something in there. Like a giant rabies-filled bat. Or a maniac who wears mannequin wigs. Or it kind of looks like a pool or something. Like a freshwater one, maybe. Let's check it out. It's not that far in. <laughs> uh, yeah, I have this thing about crawling into strange, dark, wet places that might cave in at any moment. It's not gonna... Come on, I can see it from here. It's not that far. We'll be <laughs> in and out. <laughs> in and out. <laughs> yeah, he just Fortune favors the bold. <laughs> Bye. That was an odd image. Wait a minute! Jonas! Well, I am going to just rest against here. Because I think, shh, I think I mismeasured the mat. <laughs> yeah, that guy's on, uh, that guy's on weed. Oh, she did take a picture. Hey, she ain't that, she's, she's pretty. She is pretty. Uh, sadly, I didn't get to take a picture with her. Sadly, I'd like to take a picture with her. But she is pretty. <laughs> he looks high in that picture, even though he hasn't even took the weed brownie yet. <laughs> 
So our friends on drugs and me and Jonas are going to a cave that has water in it that glows. I don't think that's a very smart idea. 10 p.m. Did it take us an hour to get through here? This is a... It's a little more than a... I think if I would have went with him like straight away. Jonas, where are you? I think if I would have went with him straight away, I would have like you know caught him. But I'm not sure. Rock climbing. So far, guys, I actually do kind of like this game. This game ain't that bad. It's uh, really fun. I like to hear all the interactions and you know everybody talking and stuff. The conversations are. Uh, Pretty, pretty good to get into. Remember, guys, I will be doing some long, dark live streams, some challenges, and matter of fact, some just you know, some challenges to do instead of just the old original uh, story mode. So, you know. Jonas, seriously, where are you? Where are you, Jonas? I'm pretty sure there was a message, I know it's called, it's called, can you uh, write it down in the comments, or even know what it was, uh, y'all would decode that for me, thank you, that would mean a little bit, I don't know what's going on, hey, why would a guy bring an ashtray down here, or a pen? About a dog. See, sure, will do. That's, that's gonna be a code for something later on. I'm pretty sure about that. See, man. Didn't you hear yeah. me calling for you? Jesus, you scared me. <laughs> I'm sorry for going ahead. I thought, I thought I heard somebody down here, but you know, obviously there isn't. But isn't this place incredible? Right. I mean, I don't even know how this, how this happens. No, it's. Uh... Beautiful. See? That's what I heard. It sounds like a person almost, right? Kinda? I don't know where it's coming from. Okay, at this point, if we stay, we're just idiots, right? Uh, we're just the horror movie morons the audience screams at to leave. <laughs> no. Maybe. <sighs> there was a light in here somewhere. I still want to see what made it. It must just be further in. Can we just go, please? I, I don't really don't like it here. <sighs> yeah, okay, we can go. Lead the way. I'm just... This place just makes me really super nervous. That's all, so... You don't have to explain. I totally get it. Let's just get back to the happy fun beach time festivities, okay? It's fine. this made out of? Is it ice? I don't know. What? Wow, how is that? Did, did you see the floating, um, triangle light uh, thing? Floating triangle thing? Um, yes. It, it must be like a, like a rainbow or like a reflection of light? Those, um, exist, right? Um, cave triangle rainbows? Sure, why that. not? Let's go with that for the time being. I think this is all tied to when you tuned in those weird signals out there in the, um, what am I trying to say? I, I think that you tuned in this little guy somehow. I think it's all the same thing. Really? You think? There's Definitely. Try your radio. Maybe that's like a frequency or something. Like if it'll have an effect. Yeah, good idea. Maybe it'll There's dance or playing? twitch or something. Let's do it. Come on. Radio time. Uh, does this guy not hear the music? Da -da -da -da. 
Alex, really, I want to see what it's going to do. Sure, do you? Just that weird noise right there. Is this... are you... is this... you? Are you doing this? Should... should I stop? No! This is awesome! What's going on and I'm scared? Ah! Wait, why did you stop? We don't even know what that thing is. Yeah, exactly. Let's find out. insane uh, uh what? who are are you who are you on the Wait. Bob tail shave tail sleeping time I'm down it's impossible I, I don't know what you mean so can't Bob tail leave children bye Alex don't ask this oh shit Happened. What? Wait, what? I'm so confused. Oh, what? I'm so confused right now, guys. What just happened? I I don't understand. The triangle and sleepy time. Alex. Is Alex. Possible? What? Are we outside? At least tell me we're outside. Oh, what's this? 11 p.m. Alex? <sighs> Are you okay? You alright? Uh, I... Think so? Think so? I don't know. God. <sighs> Are you okay? Yeah, I think. Look, I'm just gonna cut to the whatever. Like, I don't know exactly what happened what? back there. But the sign says that's an old communications tower. And I don't know about you, but I want to climb that ladder, call somebody, and get the hell back home as fast as possible. I don't want to be the party pooper here, but the part- I can't leave without my friends, okay? You're... <sighs> Ren, sure, but does that list really include Clarissa? I'm not saying leave her, but... Yes, Jonas. Clarissa's my friend, too. Okay, okay. Oh, and not for nothing. I'm fine with a little de pantsing or whatever if the <sighs> weather's right what? for it. But if this is some sort of prank or trick, I'm really, 
really not in the mood. Christ, I'm as freaked out as you are, Jonas, all right? Hey, but splitting headache and like, I feel like my fingernails are gonna shoot out of my hands. Mine too. Good, like Just cross your fingers the comm tower has a working walkie-talkie or something. Yes, sir. Where's everyone else? Ren and Clarissa. I have no idea. I don't know if they even know that anything happened. Uh, don't touch that, please. I'd really prefer not telling your mom that you're dead. She might not take too well to the news. This all seems a little much, right? Like it's just a rusty old communications tower? They're not keeping dinosaurs in here. Maybe some kids climbed it drunk, fell off, and died. I don't know, but it's here, so... Don't touch. I want to know why we were underwater and we saw things falling. Was that like the submarine or something? Radio man, Major Richard Dick Harden, who served as the tower's communications officer for eight years. From 1941 to 1972, this communications tower served many different telecommunication functions, including point to point from its receivers, microwave from its by aircraft. What's that? What's that noise? That's hidden. Called Site 82. In 1980. Their broadcast is the overlap, whatever this is, guys. It, it has to be, right? Hey, music. I saw the man, but not the dog on the wall, and then there was a little fridge cabinet thing. I, I should have explored a little bit more. Damn it. Alright, alright. I should have explored a bit more, just a little bit more. There's probably someone in that cat thing, or something. There's probably like a skeleton or something. Like it's, I saw the man, but not the dog. And then the guy who was talking about Sleepy Gal and, and leave is, is, is leave possible or something like that. Is, is there a guy trapped in that sort of triangle or something? This is confusing. I, what? I'm going to talk about the view. I can see the cave, but not Ren or anybody. What do you think happened to them? Probably heard all the noise and ran off instead of trying to come help us. Great. Huh. So if we can see them. So where we were at the beach, we were at Beacon Beach. And somehow we ended up here at the field. Huh. So we're practically across the map right now. Okay. It's locked. Let me try. Oh, after you. Oh, why, thank you. Pick lock in it. Okay. A uh, little help? Just have a little faith.
It's gonna take a little bit. Um. See? Oh my. And me without my camera. Oh god, shut up. There's a window open right here. I could just came through that window. I think that was an option. But who knows? How does this thing. There's that code again. I don't know if that's the one, guys. It might work if. Alright, well. Das! Jesus! Huh. God scared by that. Hello? Communications tower. Alex? Alex? When? Oh, Jesus, Hoppin' Christ! Thank Vishnu! I. You guys went into that hole and a bunch of stuff. I have no idea what happened. I just woke up like 15 minutes ago. I, I saw the light on in the uh, the tower thing. Hey, did you know that it's named after some guy named Dick Harden? <laughs> so he was. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> really? Man, just. It's been a rough night, you know? How'd you get this number? It's a code written on this list here. But it's not a normal phone. I can't call out. I'm at uh, the way station or whatever in the woods. It's been like, like just the worst thing ever. Just Defcon Fuchsia level terrible ever since you went into the cave. Like worse than Kendall's basement. Ren, just calm down, okay? Breathe in through your mouth and out through your nose. It's the other way around. Wait, I, I, I think that's the other line. Maybe it's like a night watchman or something. Or they do like check-ins, maybe. What's that sound? Is there a cat? Ren, someone's calling on the other line. Just. Hold on a minute. I'm gonna see who it is. Okay, but make it quick. Seriously. Hello? Oh, Jesus Christ. Alex? Why are you answering it? This... It says it's an emergency line. Where are you right now? Clarissa? And Jonas is with you. Of course he I'm is. in the comm tower, Clarissa. Where are you? I... I don't know. I'm somewhere in Fort Milner. I don't know why. I... I don't remember, like, the last hour. I'm trying to call somebody, but I'm in a room with radio stuff that can... It says it can contact Kamina, but I don't, I have no idea how to make it work. Can you just come over here and figure this out with me? I don't care if you guys want to stay, I just... Yeah, sure, we'll be over there in a minute. Okay, just hurry, okay? There's like, I don't know, I'm hearing stuff outside. Fort Milner looked Fort huge Jonah. on the map. Do you know where the... And it dies, ladies and... Ren, are you still there? Oh, damn. Yeah, I guess that'd be too easy. You told Clarissa we're coming, so want to truck over to Milner first, see about that radio? I mean, Clarissa can be a handful, but gotta take the bitter with the sweet. Uh, yeah. If we can connect to the mainland and get somebody over here, we should do it as soon as we can. My thoughts exactly. Is, um, is anyone there? It's, um, dead. I don't think that's Did you get dead. anyone? I think someone was there, but I don't know. Look, I'm gonna leave it up to you. We can swing through the forest in Nabren, or we can go to the fort and see what Clarissa's up to. They're your people. You can decide. Uh, Ren needs us Ren more. First. And he'd kill me if he knew we went to see Clarissa first. Sound logic. We, got, we gotta get Ren first, so save Ren. Or we could we go to Fort Miller. I know she said there's people outside of uh, the area and everything. She might need our help, like honestly. But we if, we're gonna need a third person, and I'm pretty sure she could just stay there. You know, guys. So, let's go for it. All right, let's figure out how to turn off this electrified fence, kickstart this rescue mission like the uh, total badasses we are. Yeah, Bad righteous. Ass. Since he's going up, I'm guessing, um, I'm guessing I'm going to put this shot at generator up there. Alright. Hello. Up uh, and the, okay. this will be uploaded to YouTube maybe in about an hour or so later. Yeah, guys, love this gameplay. I am liking it. This gives me a whole bunch of questions. So you know, those beeping and all that. Go ahead and tell me down in the comments. Check out Matt Goss's channel. He does a bunch of now. Uh, that will be in the description. Go check out his channel. Um, thank you so much, guys, for watching. I liked it, and 